we're hoping cool. to have you guys all come over to the car con to do some awesome shoots with all of the cars. Um, those of you that don't know me, I have a local uh, collection and I've got a bunch of hypercars and supercars. So it's about a, a $30 million car collection that is just a lot of fun and excitement. And then uh, what we do here at the Hamilton Collection is we share the cars with the community. So that's what we're all about, giving people access to these cars and then uh, occasionally letting people spin one of them around. We've been working hard trying to find a, find a, tr trying to find a group. And by working hard, I mean, I've probably had about, I don't know, 150 different people over the last like 12 hours message us about this. And uh, probably more than that. Um, everybody, everybody wanted to like borrow a car from homecoming. And, and so ultimately we thought a photo opportunity would be a great idea. However, what I want to do for you guys is let you pick any one of my cars, them to the restaurant and go to your homecoming dance. So um, we're talking $3 million Bugatti, $3 million LaFerrari. Um, so I should, I should, yes. So I'm going to, I'm going to call Maison Sabika, try to make sure that they can have spots lined up because you, when you roll, you got to roll them all together. Harry's gonna be the uh, the escort today to make sure that they keep nice and safe. Oh, okay, all right, all right, I get it. Okay, that makes some sense. They don't know yet, but they're gonna have to. Do we have darts, right? Yeah, there we go. All right, good. They're gonna be throwing darts uh, at at various amazing pictures of Tommy because Tommy loves these pictures being public, and uh, to see which car they drive. Wow, it got so quiet. First off, thank you guys for coming out here. You crushed it. So I, I was just talk. I was just talking to one of the parents that we we disguised this as a like. Who wants to come take pictures with the cars? Because I, I'd, if I would have said who wants to go drive twenty million dollars worth of cars, then I would we would have gotten a million thousand messages. But uh, but we were trying to find someone that was genuine, that was like just looking for something as easy as pictures, and uh, you crushed it. And so so it made it a lot easier to to like be like to surprise you guys with that because again he wasn't here to drive them, he was here just to do pictures for you all. So good job, brother. We're gonna do a fun thing to see who gets to drive what. All right, we're gonna have some fun. We have nine of the vehicles here. Let me let me give you the disclosure first, right? These are mostly hyper cars, not just supercars. So you are driving cars that are that are significantly more horsepower even than supercars. So as long as you drive and just kind of look out for each other, you don't want to be racing each other, passing each other up. Even when our crew drives aggressively, we're not trying to like pass each other up. We're, we're always looking out for each other, making sure that they can get in the traffic. So you'll be fine. Just don't break anything, please. <laughs> So we'll pick, we'll pick this as the line, and if the people that are actually driving want to line up, we're going to go ahead and throw a dart at, uh, at whichever Tommy face. Uh, let, me try, let me try and throw one of these darts, too. I'm just going to test it out myself. I just want to throw one right at Tommy's face. All right, it works. <laughs> 918. All right, I got the 918. I'm just kidding. Wow, 488. All right. P1. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Go to your car and then we're going to show you guys how to use them because they're all complicated in their own way. You're going to start it like any other normal car. That's Turn off your parking know. brake. I'm going to kill it just because it's so loud. Um, you see how it has the brake light on right there that tells you the parking brake's on? Easy way to figure it out is there's only drive, neutral, reverse. Obviously you don't want to put it in drive when you stop and you don't want to put it in reverse when you stop. So throw it in neutral. Pull that up so that it shows the brake is on, and then you just shut it off. So that one extra step is just this brake. Oh, actually, this one's not really that complicated. Um, so, so you'll you'll turn the key all the way. Go ahead and do that. Do you have only have high heels as well? No, no we, we have our flats. Yeah. Smart. We're, yeah, we're not that. You ladies either. are so smart. Okay. Um, and then you're gonna hold the brake and then hit the engine start button. If you can't reach, there's the. But I bet you don't know how to get in neutral when you stop. No. Both pedals in. So okay. that's going to put it in neutral. So whenever you're all done, first thing you do is get it in neutral. Okay. Yeah. Parking brake on so it doesn't roll. Yeah. And then you just turn the key off. Okay. So pull the brake and hit that.
kept it a secret. But to contain our happiness, we made a Spotify million dollar car playlist. <laughs> and it's like, well, how many hours is it? It's eight hours and 41 minutes. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it, but there you go. <laughs> to Mason Sapika, um, but we're gonna get food here. We're a little bit late to our reservation, but that's fully fine. So we'll catch you later. Hey, thanks, Steve. We appreciate it. We appreciate it. Thank you, man. Thank you, man. Yeah. Woo. 